Hello, welcome to product 10, Mexican Gastronomy. Do you like Mexican food? Mmm, what is your favorite dish? What can you see in the picture? Can you see beans, avocado, probably chilaquiles? Mmm, can you think about your favorite Mexican dish? What is it? Probably you like mole, tamales, tacos, pozole, barbacoa, arroz con leche, chicken soup, chiles rellenos. Mmm, I love Mexican food. But why are they names in Spanish? Let me tell you, just as your name, some names of Mexican dishes don't change to another language. For example, Valeria is the same in English as in Spanish, Valeria. What about Francisco? Mm. What about Valentín, Sergio, Carla? These are proper names. The same happens with the Mexican dish. We cannot change pozole to English. We cannot change barbacoa to English. But what about chicken soup? That is a name in Spanish and it can also be translated to English. So most of the Mexican dish won't change their name. Okay? Mmm, what can you see on the picture? What can you eat during Christmas time? Or maybe after a posada? Do you like pozole? Do you eat pozole after a posada? Or during Christmas? What about a rainy day? I'm sure your mom loves cooking a delicious and healthy chicken soup for you in a rainy day. Is that correct? Mmm. What about tamales? After Rosca de Reyes, you probably eat tamales. Do you like them? And what about Sunday in the morning? Do you like going to buy barbacoa on Sunday morning? Do you wake up early? Mm, most of the people like barbacoa in a Sunday morning. What do you eat when you get together with your family? Do you have a big family or do you have a small family? Do you like when your grandma cooks or when your father cooks? Probably your aunt or your uncle cook better. What about your mom? Who cooks the most delicious mole, chile rellenos, or probably arroz con leche? Tacos! Any day, any time, anywhere. We have different kinds of tacos. I'm sure you like tacos mañaneros, 
tacos al vapor, tacos de trompo, mm, or maybe tacos de bistec. Which ones are your favorite? Do you know a dish from another country? What about France? United States? Argentina? Japan? Or Italy? Do you know a dish from another country? Or maybe you can mention another country do you have a favorite dish from another country? Think about it. Here we have some examples of dishes from another country. For example, pizza and spaghetti from Italy. Sushi from Japan, bread from France, empanadas from Argentina, and burgers from the US. Do you like this kind of food? Mm. Probably you don't have to go to another country to try them. I'm sure you have tried them before here in Mexico. What about the ingredients? What do we use to cook? Can you see some ingredients? Do you know them? Can you mention some from your favorite dish? What do we use to cook Mole. What do we use to cook chicken soup? What do we use to cook tacos? Can you mention the ingredients? Can you think of them? Here we have some vegetables. Asparagus, artichoke, beans, beetroot, broccoli, Brussels sprout, cabbage, carrot, cauliflower, celery, corn, cucumber, eggplant, garlic, ginger, green onion, leek, lentil, lettuce, onion, peas, pepper, potato, pumpkin, radish, spinach, sweet potato, tomato, turnip, and zucchini. Mmm, these are some of the vegetables that you can use to cook your favorite dish. But not only vegetables, I think you will need salt, pepper, water, and probably fruits. Here we have some fruits. Apple, kiwi, banana, watermelon, grapefruit, grapes melon, orange, lemon, peach, plum, coconut, pineapple, mango, blackberry, cherry, gooseberry. These are some of the fruits that you use to cook your favorite dish.
Now it's time to work. You will have to choose your favorite Mexican dish. Then you have to write the list of the ingredients. Last, you have to write and draw the steps to follow. Now think, which is your favorite Mexican dish? Do you know the ingredients to cook it? Or probably you have to go with your mom, or your dad, or your grandma, or your grandpa, or your neighbor, or your uncle, or aunt. Probably they can help you make the list of the ingredients, write and draw the steps to follow, and share with your classmates. Look, here is my work. My favorite Mexican dish is enchiladas. The ingredients are corn tortillas, panela cheese, and oil. The steps to follow are First, pour one cup of oil into a medium-sized pan and heat until it's hot. Second, Dip each tortilla, one at a time, into the hot oil until it is warmed. Third, place a little less than one-fourth cup of cheese down the center of the tortilla and roll it. Fourth, repeat this step until you have the number of enchiladas you need on the dish. Probably you need two. <gasps> or maybe if you are really hungry, you need eight or twenty. Fifth, sprinkle some cheese over the enchiladas. Finally, you may add avocado and Mexican salsa. Can you see the pictures? You will have to draw your favorite dish, the steps to follow, and the ingredients. Make a good work! It's your turn! Don't forget to share your work with your classmates. Mm. Everyone will have a good time listening to the work of others. Thank you. See you next time.